Now, at first thought, it might seem as if you two really know each other. You've been, you've known each other since fifth grade, been dating for nine years, but today really is only the beginning. And just ask anyone here who's been married for 60 years. I'm gonna love you till the well runs dry Holding your hand till we close our eyes All my days for all of time I'm gonna love you till the well runs dry and the classroom to working together for grandpa over the summers. We've learned a lot from her example and from her work ethic. Over the course of high school, whether we were spending time at our second home, which would be the Mutz's house, or cruising around the ranger, burning out that clutch, trying to teach ourselves how to drive stick, there was always one thing in common. Matt was letting us know that he had to leave to go hang out with Lauren soon. Matt makes a perfect match for Lauren because he brings the same strong will and determination to the table. We're so glad you two wound up together as high school sweethearts so many years ago. Fireflies and fields of gold I'll be holding you till time grows old. Cause you're the breath that fills my lungs. Honey, I need you, you're the only one. I need you, you're the only one. come into this house of God to enter into marriage and may the Lord strengthen this seal you are about to undertake. May he bless you through this special sacrament for in this sacrament of marriage you will become not just one flesh but one spirit. Your spirits will be bonded forever never to be separated by anything that comes along. Matt, do you take Lauren for your lawful wife? to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love, to cherish, 
Until death do you part? I do. Matt and Lauren, may you be blessed in your children, have solace in your friends, and enjoy true peace with everyone. Amen. And may the two of you be witnesses in the world to God's love. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. And it is now my pleasure to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Haley. Myself, Tracy and Joe, I would like to welcome and thank everyone for coming to the celebration of Lauren and Matt's wedding. As you look around this room, know that everyone here is here to love and support you today and through your milestones as a married couple. In all seriousness, Matt, we already feel like you have been a part of our family for quite some time. We are happy to officially welcome you to our family today. We feel like we not only gained a son-in-law, but an extended family with Joe and Tracy, Krista and Tyler, Waylon and Phoebe, and Molly and Josh. Lauren, Mom, and I are so proud of your dedication to following your dream. You are almost done, and I guess we will have a doctor in the family. It's just that Matt made sure it won't be a Dr. Jaden. <laughs> but that's okay. Doctor otherwise is all good. Now let's raise a glass to not-so-new beginnings and a life filled with love and happiness. We love you both so much. Congrats to the new Mr. and Mrs. Haley. Now when you Google how to write a best man speech, it always says to end it with some, some sort of advice. I'll let you know, Matt, I'm only one year ahead of you. I'll text you and keep you updated as I figure it out. <laughs> so, here's to the happy couple.